I wasn't planning to make a video in a while, but I was inspired to make one because of Erica's stream. And I do want to say goodbye to our chimp nipple governor. I know I have been hot on our pussy fingering grandma ending modern day Hitler, and I thought I'll be happy losing our supreme commander, but honestly I'm having mixed feelings about it. Regardless how you feel about him, you gotta admit his YouTube apology video was 10 out of 10. My favorite part is when he said you have all the facts, but what you need to do is go on my website for all the alternative facts. After watching his YouTube apology videos, I realized he's being misunderstood. He's not a rapist, he's Italian. And if you don't know, Italians talk with their hand, so when he needs to talk about somebody's pussy during work, it only makes sense if he put his finger on it to really get the message across. He said he learned it from his mom, and my mom taught me that if I'm catcalling girls on the street, I'm not being a sexist, I'm being a New Yorker. Cause my mom always said, if you don't have anything nice to say, don't say it, and all I'm saying on the street is all nice things. I think we all need to take a step back to stop criticizing each other and really start respecting each other's culture. So today I'm going to teach you a little bit about Chinese culture or some Chinese characters. So when you invite your Asian friends over for stew, make sure you tell them Guo Mo Go. That means I'm not cooking dog or there's no dogs in the pot so they don't set their expectations too high. The next one is a bit harder, and this is also the reason why I love Chinese. This is called an idiom. Don't get confused with idiots. Idioms are words that translate into one thing, but mean something completely different. Idiots are people who think they are Asian people in America that's cooking dogs. A three pound chihuahua is about $800. That comes out to about $266 a pound. An imported Japanese A5 Wagyu is only about $120 a pound. Eating dogs here doesn't make any mathematical sense. Unless, anyways, this one reads Fa Yo Xiu Fu and it translates to the flower needs to be trimmed. But you don't use it like that. You only use this one when your Asian girlfriend is getting a little hairy down there. Then you gotta hit her with the fa yao xiu fu. So to recap, today we learned guo mo go fa yao xiu fu. And the best way to learn Chinese is to memorize it by repeating it over and over again like this. Guo mo go fa yao xiu fu. Guo mo go fa yao xiu fu. Guo mo go fa yao xiu fu. Alright guys, try to memorize that as much as you can and I'll see you in the next class. Peace!